Incoming call. Patching it through. There's been a development regarding the spy, Venturev. Rendezvous at Crawler's Song. Your contact's codename is Shayna. Shayna? Got it. Hey! Piss off. You order, you pay. I said... You look like you're waiting for someone. I've got time for a drink. Shayna. But you can call me Reyes. I hate the code names. I was expecting someone more... Angaran. <laughs> the Resistance pays me to supply information. Among other things. So you're a smuggler? Your man, Venterev, was arrested by Sloan Kelly, leader of the Outcasts. Word spread about what he did to Moshe Sefa. The people are calling for his execution. And Sloan? <laughs> She's a woman of the people. I like her already. Well, she doesn't like you. She's never met me. You work for the Initiative. Sloan was part of the uprising on the Nexus. I doubt she'll give Ven up easily. Maybe she'll agree to a deal. There might be another way to get to Ven. You work Sloan. I'll talk to the Resistance. How do I contact you if things go south? Hey, you gotta pay. Keep the change. Always do. Over here. Have a nice chat? I think she likes me. <laughs> Don't worry. I found a workaround. Let me guess. It comes with strings attached. Not any new ones. Remember, Ephra wants Ven alive, so when you get inside, give him this. That'll eat through whatever Sloan's holding him in, and it can't be traced back to us. A resistance agent will be waiting to pick Ven up. Ven's intel better be worth it. <laughs> You'll be the judge of that, not me. There's a maintenance shaft around the corner, sending the access code to your Omni tool. That'll get you inside. You should be able to handle the rest. Thanks. You're a lifesaver. Literally, in Ven's case. When you're done, come to Tartarus. First round's on me. I promise. Reyes should be here. I detect no sign of Mr. Vidal, Pathfinder. Shall we proceed without him? That's not... Don't move. Were we too loud? Shut up. Farrow will deal with you. I don't need to tell you what happens next. You're gonna to try to kill me and my friends. I've got a few questions first. No. You'll bleed, just like the others. So it's true. You murdered innocent people. Invaders and sympathizers are not innocent. I will protect my home. Don't let your hate poison you. We can coexist. Like here on Kadara. Sloan lies to my people and uses them for power. I'm not Sloan. You are all the same. 
Not so fast. You're late. I've got a good reason. You'll see in three. Don't just stand there! Two. Kill them! Still mad? Die! The streets of Kadara are safe again. You did good, Ryder. Don't worry. I'll let all the important people know who to thank. Always good working with you, Reyes. Next time, let's skip the murder and go straight to the bar. Name the time and place. I'll be there. That's the spirit. Don't be a stranger, Pathfinder. Ryder! Perfect timing. You saved me the trouble of looking for you. You're a needy guy, Reyes. Stop being useful, and I'll stop bugging you. Give me the details. A business rival, Zia Cordier, lifted cargo I was moving for a client. You want my help getting it back? We worked so well together on the row car job, I thought you'd be willing. What did she steal? No idea. Client paid extra for privacy. Considering my fees, it must be valuable. You didn't check? Honors got a price. And the client paid it. How'd this rival of yours get hold of your cargo? Her usual tactics. Got my middleman drunk and stole his ship. Sounds like you know from experience. Please, I keep to a three-drink maximum when I'm on a job. We cut the profits. 50-50. 60-40. <laughs> Final offer. Deal. When she stops in Kadara, Zia drinks at Krala's song. We'll start there. See if Umi heard anything that could help us. You look like you're waiting for someone. That's my line. Ugh. You want a drink or a room? Information, actually. That'll cost you more than a round of drinks. My friend's good for it. You still owe me for the last time. Fine, fine. It was just a joke. I've got a bottle of Elasa I'm willing to part with. <sighs> what do you want to know? Sia Cordier. She been around recently? You mean your ex? Yeah, she was here. You never mentioned Zaya was your girlfriend. <sighs> She's not. We drink together sometimes. I drink with a lot of people. Anyway, she was here? Yeah, met with a Solarian. Shifty guy I'd never seen before. Maybe it was the charlatan. Anything's possible. You overhear their conversation? They were planning to meet someone at Spiris Ledge. Thanks, Umi. Whatever. You didn't hear it from me. If you check the meeting spot, I'll follow the collective lead. Doubt Zia was meeting the charlatan, but you never know. Why am I always stuck with the hard work? Because I'm the delicate one. Call me when you get to the meeting spot. Got word from one of my colleagues. Ben Taref made it off Kadara. He's a free man. Thanks to you. You got me in? It's what I do. Your code name, Shana. What's it mean? It's the Angaran word for... mouth. <laughs> I'm... Good with words. Uh huh. A regular poet. <laughs> I didn't choose it. Things are looking less than friendly between the collective and the outcasts. Not everyone's happy living under Sloane's thumb. Whatever resources Kadara has goes to the outcasts. The rest of us get scraps. The collective claims to be different, but it's hard to trust a faceless leader. Especially with a title like the Charlatan. <laughs> have to admit, I'm jealous. That's a better nickname than Shayna. Did you play a big part in the mutiny on the Nexus? <laughs> I had nothing to do with that shit show. Then why'd you leave? The way Tan handled things didn't exactly inspire confidence. Decided I could do better on my own. So I jumped ship with the rest of them. Ended up here. How long have you worked with the Resistance? A few months. 
When Sloan saved Kadara Port from the Ket, Ephra wanted eyes and ears on the ground. Figured people would be more loose-lipped around their own kind. He was right. Sloan's tough, but so are the Ket. How'd she take them out? Never underestimate the element of surprise. The Ket weren't ready for an ambush. But they know her tactics now. Next time, Sloan won't be so lucky. I better get going. Ryder. Yeah? Don't take this the wrong way, but... You're not really liked here, in Kadara Port. Ouch. What I'm saying is, you need a friend. Someone on the inside to help you out. I can be that guy. You need intel on exiles, Sloan, whatever. Come to me. Thanks. I think. Ryder. How's my favorite Pathfinder? Just enjoying another day of what Helios has to offer. Why? Thought we could grab a drink. Sloan's holding a get-together for the locals. I managed to snag an invite. Care to be my plus one? Sloan doesn't seem like the party type. She sees these events as a necessary evil to keep the people happy. I'd never say no to free drinks. Especially from Sloan's reserve. I'll meet you outside Outcast HQ. Hold up. This is a private event. Name's Ryder. Human Pathfinder? I'm kind of a big deal. There's no Ryder on the list. He's with me. Reyes Vidal. Go on in. Reyes Vidal. I was beginning to think you wouldn't show. Remember what I said about fashionably late? Shh. Introduce me to your companion. Pathfinder? Meet Kima Dorgan. The Angaran representative to Sloan and uh, a friend. I didn't think Reyes had friends. Only contacts and colleagues. Oh, I'm those as well. Who do you think secured him an invitation to this event? Sorry to cut this short, but I need to take care of something. Abandoning me already? It won't take long. There are important players here tonight. You should mingle, make a good impression. You're gonna be playing catch up on all the fun. I work best one step behind. Promise. And there he goes. Any idea what he's up to? It's better not to worry about what Reyes does. Enjoy the party. Damn it. Why can't the serial numbers be in the same spot? Take the night off. Come out for a drink. Should have known you were up to something. Ryder, it's not what it looks like. So you didn't use me as a distraction to go through Sloan's stuff? <laughs> okay, yes. But it's for both our benefit. I You've been making a lot of promises. Shit, someone's coming. We need a distraction. Sorry. <coughs> My friend had a bit too much to drink. Hey, it worked. Next time, I come up with the plan. Finally, here it is. That's what this was all about? Whiskey? The only bottle of Mount Milgram in Andromeda. Triple distilled and 645 years old. This isn't whiskey. It's treasure. I hope you're planning on sharing. Ha. <laughs> we'll see. Let's get out of here. Gorgeous, isn't it? I sometimes forget. Is Andromeda everything you hoped it would be? Every day is an adventure. Even my nights off are interesting. What about you? Why did you come here, Reyes?
to be someone. That sounded surprisingly genuine, coming from you. I'm always genuine, Ryder. In my own way. You look like you're waiting for someone. Reyes? I'm here for the charlatan, not some third-rate smuggler. They're one and the same. Surprise. The Angaran spy. Your interest in the Rokar murders. Everything you've done has been to undermine Sloane's power. Death by a thousand cuts. You said you wanted to settle things. How? <clears throat> a duel. You and me, right now. Winner takes Kadara port. You want to avoid war by shooting each other? Two people shooting each other is better than a lot of people shooting each other. I'll take those terms. Sniper, your sights are set on slow. Get her out of here. Prepare the crew. Kadara port is ours tonight. Guess you got everything you wanted. What I want is peace. Sloan would have brought war to Helios. We don't have the population to survive that. Is Reyes even your real name? It's what my mother called me. <sighs> it's my real name. I only lied because I didn't want the rumors surrounding the charlatan to taint your view of me. From what I just saw, I'd say the rumors were right about you. Being honorable never got me anywhere, Pathfinder. So what now? I get to work. Kadara port won't take itself. Thought you'd be in the throne room. Tartarus is a little shabby for Kadara's new leader, don't you think? Come on, Ryder. You know I prefer to rule from the shadows. You are a shady bastard. Guilty as charged. The Angara you met at Sloane's party, Kima Dorgan. She's agreed to be my front. And with Sloane gone, there's room for the initiative on Kadara. I'll start rounding up volunteers for an outpost. Might take a while. You exiles have a reputation. Not all of us are thieves and murderers. I am, but some of the others are perfectly nice. Perfectly. Jokes aside, I want this outpost just as much as you do. It will have my full protection. That's a promise. And how much will that promise cost me? The trade your outpost will bring in should cover it. What's this? It's a handshake. We're partners now. Partners and friends. <laughs>